2100 uh, kilometer. Good. Good morning from Sacramento. This is uh, not a Tech Talk Tuesday to be aired on Wednesday because it's Friday. Uh, but we're gonna, uh, it'll show up on Saturday. So super awesome bike Saturday. I don't know. It's my, uh, my GQ pose, bro. You know. So as you can see, we're at the shop. Uh, quick morning, uh, morning rundown. We're gonna take about five minutes to run through this. We, uh, we kicked the guys out. They were here and then they didn't want to be in the video. So we kicked them out. They're watching some video. So let's, uh, let's run through the bike. Boom. My favorite quote when riding this bike is, like, that's a super awesome looking cross bike. It's not. This is a road bike. So this is a tarmac disc. <laughs> Probably one of my favorite riding bikes. Super fast, super agile, uh, really, really, really fun. Just quick, snappy, responsive bike. Plus disc brakes, plus big tires, plus one chain ring. So super fired up on it. Um, we'll start up front. We've obviously got zip cockpit and a, a force one by drivetrain. No shifter here and, uh, and only on the rear. We'll get to that in a, in a split second. 303 disc brake wheels, carbon clinchers set up with the turbo 28 tire. Super, super comfy and, uh, and plush riding. Good for off-roady adventures. Um, I always, uh, the OG gravel bike is a road bike. So this is, uh, this is what it's all about. Come on this way, we'll move back. So we are running a uh, one by chain ring, as you can see, 50 tooth up front, no front to rail, they're super clean, crisp looking, um, and just nice cable routing, nothing, uh, nothing to get in the way up here and just clean aesthetics. But with the one by drivetrain, we run the mega, mega range cassette out back 1042 uh mountain bike cassette but it's on the road bike it plugs onto the uh onto the 303s with the xd driver body which is dope so we've got full-blown gearing for every adventure under the sun when in when in the top cog 50 42 that's the same gear ratio as a mid compact the 36 28 so no problem there can easily uh, easily muscle up any uh, any steep climb out there with that gear ratio, and then dropping it all the way down to the 10. So a 50-10 is a five to one gear ratio, which means it's the equivalent of a 55-11, which I don't know anybody running that on your road bike, so mega, mega, mega gear ratio there. So as you can see, clearance is a little, little snug there, but it's still there. So no, no problems with running that big of a tire on here. Nothing to actually interfere with the frame. So we're, uh, we're pushing it to the limits, but we're still within the limits. So that's where the fun's found when you're pushing it, pushing it that far. So quick note, with a forced drivetrain, to run this mega cassette, you need the long cage derailleur. So on all of our cross bikes, we run the mid cage, which allows us to run up to a 36 tooth. But with this, this mega range with the 42, we gotta, we gotta bump it up. We're gonna run the long cage, gives you some more uh, B tension or B, uh, B gap extra zonage there. I don't even know if that's a technical term, but gives you some more uh, some more movement there. Yeah! We run a 140 rotor up front and in back. Both 140 front and rear. Small rotor, clean, simple. I like it though because it's a direct mount. No adapters, no spacers, super flush, clean work, money, money setup. I like things that, uh, that plug in, no spacers, washers, adapters, make it, uh, make it nice and smooth. That's a wrap. On my uh, on my tarmac disc, I really really like this thing. You're gonna see a lot more of this in the vlog over the uh, the spring and summertime. Fun dirt adventures. Bring the point and shoot along. Capture it all. Have some fun. Uh, we're going to go through a bit of a. We are currently in a bit of a, a dry spell with the the riding. Taking a nice little break after nationals. But give it another uh, another few days, and we're gonna be back at it and fun. Fun rides will will commence. The weather has been super nasty outside, but it's coming around. So uh, yeah, I think that's it for the uh, that's it for the bike check of the day. If you've never ridden a disc brake road bike, I highly recommend it. Everyone is very very skeptical about it, but just like with mountain bikes and cross bikes, soon to be road bikes, disc brakes are going to be here. They're going to be the thing. They already are the thing. But if you're a little late to the game, I'll give you a little bit of benefit of the doubt. But you've got to get on one. A bike like this, big tires, disc brakes, mega range cassette. It completely changes the game on road riding. There's the phone. I'm hop to it. With that said, over and out, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace.